माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स आई अमनदीप कौर आई होप यू ऑल आर वेल वीवर ऑन चैप्टर सेवन जियोमेट्री सो इन द लास्ट वीडियो लेक्चर आई हैव एक्सप्लेन द बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ जियोमेट्री एंड द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन पॉइंट एंड लाइन टूडे वी विल डिस्कस एंगल एंड टाइप्स ऑफ एंगल सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू मस्ट नो वॉट इज एन एंगल two rays with a common end point form an angle so you can see here ab and cb are two rays they meet at point b so there is formation of angle abc and the middle letter where these two rays meet so that point is called vertex of the angle the common end point of these two rays where they meet is called vertex of the angle so b is the vertex of angle angles are formed between two rays extending from a single point even so you can see angles are commonly drawn as an arc so here is red color shown is an arc so this way we can show a angle even angles are measured in degrees we measured angles in degrees so dear children look at this image do you know what we are looking up exactly there are angles you can see on the door there are four corners so the four corners there are many angles so dear students if you look around you will see we are surrounded by many angles you can see angles in the cone of ice cream and even the slices of pizza the slices of pizza have angles now the interior of an angle the reason that lies within the angle is the interior part of an angle so you can see here area shown with the white color inside the angle that is the interior part of the angle same the points lying inside the angle form the interior of an angle now exterior of an angle the reason that which is shown with the sky blue color that is like that lies outside the angle so that forms the exterior part of an angle the points lying outside the angle form the exterior of an angle so how we can name that angles angles can be named in different ways we can name an angle by using three letters of alphabets english alphabets or we can write only with the middle letter and even we can use as numerals so you can see here in the first figure when three letters are used to name an angle so three letters are a b and c b is the vertex of angle so it will be in the center so there is angle a b c even we can denote only with the middle letter of angle that is b is the middle letter vertex so angle b so third is 1 angle 1 so with the numeral written so here you can write angle 2 2 also any number you can write angle 2 also you can write here angle 2 this symbol we used for denoting angle so here in the second there is angle b angle b in the first is angle abc angle abc b is the vertex so it will be in the center or we can write like this also angle c b a always keep in mind b will be in the center because here in that figure b is the vertex of an angle so now we use you can see in that picture there is protector protector is commonly used to measure angles protectors are usually made is of semi circular shape and it is made up of 
ट्रांसपेरेंट प्लास्टिक सो हियर ऑन द प्रोटेक्टर यू कैन सी टू स्केल्स सो नंबर्स जीरो टू वन हंड्रेड एटी डिग्री इज मैंशन देयर एंड जीरो इज ऑन द बॉटम लाइन यू कैन सी हेयर जीरो इज ऑन द बॉटम लाइन एंड नंबर्स जीरो टू वन हंड्रेड एटी डिग्री मैंशन देयर ऑन द आउटर स्केल दैट इज क्लॉक वाइज एंड इन साइड ऑल्सो यू कैन सी सेम नंबर्स जीरो टू वन हंड्रेड एटी डिग्री मैंशन सो दीज मूव एंटी क्लॉक वाइज so these numbers we use to measure angle now let's find the measure in degrees of each angles which are given here so first is you need to measure angle aob angle aob so you can see here zero lies on the bottom line o is in the center so a also lies on the bottom line you need to measure angle aob you can see here angle aob so aob we will use here outer scale so this line ob lies on 10 degree so measure of angle aob will be 10 degree measure of an angle aob will be 10 degree now d part you can see here measure of angle foa you can see here f is there o is in the center a is on the bottom line so angle foa you need to measure this angles angle you can see here this point f is lying outer scale you can see in c it is 70 degree so you will see here outer scale there is 90 degree so it is more than 90 you can see this line more than 90 so we will more use it as outer scale so it is 110 degree 110 degree so angle of foa is 110 degree so same as you can solve other parts so now classification of the angles means types of an angles angle can be classified on the basis of their measures so first is acute angle acute angle whose whose measure is more than 0 degree but less than 90 degree you can see here angle a b c is an acute angle even you can read it as angle c b a this is an acute angle because it measures more than 0 degree but less than 90 degree now there is next is right angle angle whose measure is exactly 90 degree is called right angle angle whose measure 90 degree is right angle so measure of an angle x y z is 90 degree so this angle is right angle so now third type is obtuse angle obtuse angle the angle whose measure is more than 90 degree but less than 180 degree is called obtuse angle is called obtuse angle so here in the figure angle rst is more than 90 degree more than 90 degree so this is obtuse angle that is obtuse angle now fourth type is straight angle angle whose measure is 180 degree angle whose measure is 180 degree is called straight angle so it will be in the form of straight line so here measure of angle lmn is 180 degree so next type is reflex angle that is reflex angle angle an angle the measure of which is greater than 180 degree but less than 360 degree is called a reflex angle is called a reflex angle so here in the figure angle p q r is a reflex angle the angle is 250 degree so that is 
रिफ्लेक्स एंगल नाउ द लास्ट इज कंप्लीट द एंगल सो एंगल हुज मेजर इज 360 सिक्सटी डिग्री इज अ कंप्लीट एंगल एंगल अराउंड अ पॉइंट और यू कैन से इन अ सर्कल इज मेजर 360 हंड्रेड सिक्सटी डिग्री सो हेयर यू कैन सी मेजर ऑफ एंगल डी ई एफ मेजर ऑफ एंगल डी ई एफ फॉर्मिंग अ सर्कल सो दैट मेजर इज थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी डिग्री सो दैट इज अ कंप्लीट एंगल फुल सर्कल थैंक्स Stay home stay safe have a good day